That breaking news, a bear sighting in Marin County. Chopper 5 is live over the scene in San Anselmo where there are confirmed reports of a bear in a tree. KPIX 5's Andrea Nakano is live at the scene for us. Andrea, not completely unheard of. Mount Tam is right in the neighborhood. Yeah, but I, I mean, we are almost right in the heart of downtown San Anselmo. So this is quite rare. I just talked to the homeowner here and he says he's lived in this home for 30 years and he has never seen or heard anything like this. We're actually right here at the intersection of Cedar and Tamil Pius. And I'll have my photographer kind of show you. Oh, well, actually, we're going to go to some video from above that we caught. But this bear apparently is perched up in the oak tree. The bear is about two to three hundred pounds. I'm hearing and right now what they're trying to do is get the Department of Fish and Wildlife here to handle this situation. They say that the bear is perched. It's hiding right now, not moving at all, not trying to come down because as you can imagine from the chopper and all of the people down here, there is a lot of noise. So the bear might actually be a little bit scared. But anyways, right now, this is what the scene going on. As you can see right behind me here, over here, I want to show you the crowd. There are a whole bunch of people gathered here. They were actually gathered right in front of this home when we arrived on scene. They have been pushed back because officials from the city of San Anselmo came out here and said that we don't know what this bear is going to do, how it's going to react. It might just come down this driveway. So they wanted the people to kind of get back just a little bit for now to make sure that nobody is injured out here. Obviously, the goal is to try to get the bear down safely. We're hoping that the Department of Fish and Wildlife can come down here, help crews with the Marin Humane Society that are here right now, and get this bear on the ground safely and to a more of its natural habitat because we are probably just a block away from downtown San Anselmo. So this is really just a busy area here and very unexpected to see a bear. All right, Andrea, thanks. Another live look from Chopper 5, and of course, we'll stay on top of this. We're getting some more information on our breaking story this evening. Chopper 5 live over the scene in San Anselmo, where there is a bear in a tree. At KPI x Five's Andrea Nakano is live at the scene. She's got the latest. Andrea? Yeah, Ken and Liz, we do have some more information and some new video to show you about this bear. This bear is perched behind this home in an oak tree right about 40 feet high and we captured some video of the video of the bear and as you can see it's just kind of calmly sitting up there right now not moving a lot but it is curious about what's going on around him just as the people around here are very curious about what's going on with this bear now the public information officer just told me she was from the central marine police department she says that they are indeed waiting for the Department of Fish and Wildlife to come here to handle this situation. Right now, their goal is to just contain a bear up on the tree. Like I said, it was about 40 feet up high. And then once Department of Fish and Wildlife arrive on scene, then they will kind of see what the next step is, whether it's to tranquilize the bear and try to transport him safely to another location. But this bear is about two to 300 pounds, a small bear, and it is is right near the town of San Anselmo, right near the city center. We talked to the mayor today, and this is what he had to say. Amazing, actually. Oh, yeah, no, it's it's probably a five-minute walk downtown and about uh, three minutes from where I live. So we are right here in the heart of San Anselmo. But, you know, luckily, Central Marin Police Authority is on the scene, um, one, to make sure that the bear is safe and to make sure that the, the neighbors are safe. They've reached out to Fish and Game, and I'm sure uh, as the time is right um, and the appropriate authorities get here, we'll do what we can to ensure the safe return of the bear to its natural habitat. Yeah. You have kids, right? I do. I do. Have, have they been out here? Like, has this been a... My, when my daughter found out... So as he has a child and his daughter came here in her swimming suit right before she had swim practice. And that is the case. If um, my photographer can pan over here, you can see there are a number of kids just behind the yellow tape here. They say that they just want to see this bear, but it is really kind of hidden in that oak tree away from 
the visibility of people here from the street angle. It's pretty tucked far on the other side. So we did get a picture of it. We have video of it. We do know that there is a bear in a tree, but you really can't see it from the street over here. And right now it's being contained and we're just waiting for the fish and wildlife to respond. Yeah, Andrea, quick question before we let you go. I, I, I looked at the video, the, I mean, in, in, at the risk of sounding cavalier, is there a chance they just clear people back, let the sun go down and kind of let the bear come down naturally and uh, maybe deal with them then or let him wander off or has that been discussed? Yeah, I don't know if that's been discussed, but I'm guessing that they're not going to just let this bear wander off because we are really close to downtown San Anselmo. I think the goal is to try to get this bear maybe tranquilized and then transport it back to some sort of natural habitat for this animal. Andrea, you're so close to downtown, as the mayor said, as, as you said multiple times. Have they ever seen anything like this before ever and the people that have lived there for many years? Yeah, I talked to the mayor. He's never seen anything like this. And I talked to the homeowner here where the bear is just kind of sitting in his backyard. He's lived in this home for 30 years, and he says he's never seen anything like this. So this is really a rare occurrence right in this part. Andrea Nakano reporting live. I guess, I guess you would remember, wouldn't you, if you lived there 30 <laughs> years, whether a bear came cruising through. Give me another bear. shot of Chopper 5, uh, obviously. Uh, it's a wooded area, neighborhood, and the bear feels comfortable. It didn't look all that menacing up in the tree, but you never know. He's a wild animal. So. There, you can never take any chances.